Which one of the funniest Candace stories I remember? Definitely the hamster one. <laughs> I remember in class when teaching Candace the art of Tafango, she said to me, Sensei, I would like a pet. A pet dog, a pet snake, a pet lizard. So they decided on getting a hamster at Petco because they were like on sale for eight bucks and it was a small furry animal. And she named them Princess. Yo, do I look like a princess? When they got home, they had to get him into a cage and they all were scared because, you know, it was this furry little freaky thing. The, and I don't blame them, it's a furry rat. That's what I think it is, a rat. What the f you think I'm a rat? I'm no f***ing rat. I'm a f***ing hamster. Candace tried to take it out with a tissue and she got the hamster so scared that he passed out and fainted. So they rolled it into the cage. I took it easy on them, so I played like I was fainted. I wasn't the fainted, I played I was fainted. Uh, the first couple of nights, you know, the hamster loved to run. I mean, that's what hamsters do. So every night, it's ring, 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 you'd hear ring, 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 which was the hamster in the, the cage, the, the, the spinny thingy. The father, you know, he got up in the middle of the night thinking someone was breaking in. Oh my God, I would have died. You know, being the warrior that he is, came down with a bat to find out who was breaking in. It was the hamster princess running around. Now, I mean, you know, mind you, he did want to protect them. You know what I'm saying? You'd run too if you were in a goddamn cage all the time. All I wanted to do was get the f out. Vanessa one day wanted to clean the cage, and what she did, she took the, the cage out. She took the hamster out of the cage and put him in the bowl. But she didn't close the thing all the way. Candace came in and looked at the empty ball on the floor and said, oh, maybe mom just left it there. So she looks over to the cage and the cage is empty. And she goes, ma, where's the uh, hamster? And Vanessa does one of these, you know, looks at the cage and then looks at the ball and freaks out. And everyone starts freaking out. I got the f out of there as fast as I could. And oh my God, it was crazy. I would have died. Too bad the damn door was closed because I was out that mother they were having a competition, sort of like a little Pet Olympics over at Petco to see what hamster could run the fastest. Princess winds up winning and uh, they win a cage and they win, you know, this ball-y thing and they win this other thing, all hamster stuff. And one of the things they won were treats. Every day they gave the hamster a treat. And what wound up happening was the hamster got very fat. Yo, they couldn't give me sugar free. And those treats did her in, which sometimes happens. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry. I can't. I'm too emotional. Dead. I wasn't dead. I played dead, yo. I got a job with Kia. Yeah!